in sport, it doesn't matter what it is, I think it brings people together. People win together, they lose together, you go ups and downs, really get to feel each other's emotions. So I think sport helps to bring people closer. We work in schools all across London. The schools are seen as schools that maybe aren't doing as well or there's some social deprivation in those areas. Parents are out trying to work and make a living and maybe they don't have as much time for their young people and that's where our role is really important. If you live in a community that's a disadvantaged community, then your life chances are less. And you see that in terms of educational outcomes, you see that in health outcomes, you see that across a whole range of issues. I first got involved by coming to After School Club. From there, I kind of fell in love with the sport. Ever since then, I've just been progressing and trying to get better. I've met a lot of friends that I think I'll keep for a very long time. The benefit we have as, as being coaches based in schools means that we can also get feedback from their teachers and their peers. We continue that support network a little bit further and make it a little bit wider, so it means the young people really, really get a, a really good solid base from the time they arrive at the schools until the time they leave. If the child knows you're there full time, then they're likely to trust you more. My role in their life is more than just table tennis. I mean, the kids can open up to me, they can tell me things they can't tell other people. Whether it's to do with basketball or table tennis, or whether it's to do with life in general, whatever question I have, they're always there. Greenhouse helped me so much. They taught me about working hard, determination, grit. Seeing the smiles on the young people's faces when you teach them a new skill, or they're just participating for the first time, I get a real, real sense of achievement by I'm seeing that. The most enjoyable thing is, is seeing the progression. You know, when they first start maybe being not so great at self-reflection, not so great at self-discipline, and just seeing a person start to grow and become a young human being. Greenhouse Centre, massively exciting for us. What we'll have is a centre that will sit at the heart of the charity. The location of the Greenhouse Centre is fantastic because it's got primary schools, it's got a woman's refuge. It seems to be right in the heart of the community. We have a homework room where they're allowed to come and study and maybe get some additional support after school or on the weekends. We also have a breakout room where we're going to be able to stream live sports. Not necessarily if you go to table tennis or basketball or whatever sport we do, but to go on and actually achieve something and get a good job that they like doing is probably the most valuable thing. It's not the lack of ability that holds a young person back, it's the lack of opportunity. And what we're all about is creating those opportunities for those young people to achieve their full potential. I've just learned to be a better person in general, in terms of discipline, in terms of being a role model, in terms of leadership. That's one of the things I'm most proud of. 